Hi, this is Phil from SkiTalk.com here with David Kokia here. We got our new line for 2023, and our focus here is the all new graphics on the Thermal Trekker. Now, yeah. David, what is your position with Kokia? Uh, I'm the founder and CEO of the company, and uh, I've been running the brand for 14 years since we started up. Okay, Kokia. Yeah. Cool Kia, yep, means to trek, means to go. Okay, yep. so, and that's what we find with their products and quality wise, again, I had my original thermal trekker, I had over 450 days in that bag, and I used it, I abused it, it just held up fantastic. The quality of your products, I think are second to none in the industry. That, that's what we're known for, you know, the design being skiers and snowboarders ourselves, actually walking the walk and doing it, and then wrapping that all in the best materials and best workmanship in the in you know in the industry anywhere. Now on the thermal tracker, this bag has a ton of features and incredibly well designed. Uh, as far as our heating pads here for the boots, here on the outside it goes up both sides in the bag here, yeah. so it's kind of like a taco that just yeah. wraps around. That, well, that's the idea. We we you know unlike the the other bags that. Are, provide heat to your boots out there where they put two boots side by side in one main pocket and you only put on the heat on the outsides and the bottom of the bag or the bottom of the boots we said you know put one on each side and give it its own separate heating system much more efficient much quicker uh, and a better way to heat your boots yeah. now the amount of compartments that you also have in this bag are incredible now on the outside here there is uh, the helmet hammock yep. so if you want to put your helmet on the outside if you're out of space on the inside yep. you've got that as an right. option which that comes out of there inside here in the bag here is we've got a spot here for our goggles and this is also if you're not using a goggle sock or something yep. is felt is nice fleece lined in that so it's not going to scratch your lenses Yep. So, and also space down bottom here. Now, nice little feature that in these bags here is the inside of the bags here is a light gray, which is a very good contrast because a lot of people's accessories, it might be a neck gaiter, might be gloves, are black. That's and right. The, and you tend to lose them in the bag. That's right. And then, you you know, you lose it or you don't know if it's there. You get to the mountain, you forgot something. So, the idea is we went gray in the main pockets here where you're going to put those small items in your apparel. Yep. You know what's in your bag. Yep. The whole idea of this bag is... Other than the heat, the intuitive packing system. You know where everything is at all time. Everything has its own separate space. So a nice amount of space here. And what I also definitely appreciate with this bag, and we touched on it earlier, was the durability of the bag. I mean, when you pack this bag, and unfortunately with bags, the amount of stuff will always fill the space. So the bigger the bag is, the more stuff you put in. Yep. And what that does, that creates a lot of weight. And I am a, a lot of times a one strap person. I'll throw yep. this over the shoulder, which puts a lot of stress on these yep. arms, these are so well designed and well built. I did not any, see any breaks in any of the seams after 400 or some odd days in my other bag. You know, other than being a skier, I'm a, I'm a heavy traveler and I'm, I'm a hiker. So what I've done on this bag is wrap it all in high quality, hiking grade support system here. And you can take a look, even down here, the bar tacking, we triple bar tack. Nobody yep. else triple bar tacks. Yep. You know, we don't want our products ba uh, breaking. Yep. You even pointed out everywhere, all the stress points on this bag, heavily reinforced throughout the bag. The idea is we want quality. We don't want it to break on you when you're out there using it. No, that's really good. And you got good ventilation here as far as for wearing on your back. So if you do are perspiring at the end of the day, yep. it, it's going to dissipate that real nice and easy. Yep. Now if for traveling too is these also will tuck in here. Yep. So again, they're not going to get caught on, tra on the travel. Yep. I will say as far as airline travel, I'm one that I do not check my boot bag. It's always yep. a carry on for yep. me. I can lose my skis. I never want to lose my boots. But if you are going to check it, you can make that so the bags, the, the straps don't get caught. And what we find out is people do it on the way back on the trip. Yep. Like, okay, I'm done. If I lose my boots for a few days, I'll be fine. But on the way out, I need to take it Exactly. The and again, we got additional compartment up top here with some stuffing. We don't need that. Get that out of the way. And then space in here, again, nice light material. So again, you've got that nice contrast inside. And this falls in line with our intuitive packing system. The top pocket here, your face mask, balaclava, bandana, right on top. Yep. You know, boots on the side, in the front here, you know, your goggles, your maybe your water bottle, a lunch in there, boots on the side, everything else, the big stuff in the middle. Yep. And since this is a heated bag, wait, there's more. As far as the ability, as far as for heating the boots, you've got the ability of either 
your 12 volts in the car or a 110 if you're going to plug in in the house. So, I mean, you've got a ton of options with this bag and it's extremely versatile, extremely well built and arguably one of the best bags in the industry. And as I said, we have numerous amounts in our test fleet. A lot of our testers are using them. We love it a lot. We've got our second generation color here where original yep. ones were orange yep. we got some red on this one here now and again the black and blue one here too yep. so you've got some different color waves so if you've got multiple bags in your family you're not going to get them mixed up yep. and if you're somebody who's really looking towards sustainability we're floating it for next year's lineup recycled fabric in the bag as well yep. so you're really covering all bases on it and at a reasonable price point again thanks for watching and remember folks out there Skiing is fun. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jim Ryan. Uh, I'm in Teton Gravity Research Magic Hour. And I'm Madison Rose Ostergren. I'm in Daymaker Warren Miller's 73rd Annual Film. Yeah, and just remember, skiing is, ski is fun. Skiing is fun. <laughs> <laughs> skiing is fun, right, yeah. Jim? Yes. We will say it at the same time. One, two, three. Skiing is... One, two, three. <laughs> remember, skiing is fun. To read the full review of the ski, please go to SkiTalk.com and click on the review tab. Please also hit the like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel to see more reviews and other ski related content and add thoughts in the comment section below. Of course, follow SkiTalk.com on all of our social media channels. No posts or comments were moderated during the production of this video.